We know we're biased, but we think Knox is an awesome place to live and work in. To use more formal language from our annual report themes, it's an attractive and vibrant place. But what does that mean? Is it the look of the area in Melbourne's east? Is it the people who make it up? What about the places we live, work and play in? Well, it's all of the above. Take our big Knox at 50 program as a great example. It's been 50 years since Knox first became a shire. And just like in 1963, celebrations start with a conversation. Last year, that's what we did. We spoke with thousands of locals about the places we live in and how we want to see them grow, develop and how we want some things to stay the same too. Knox at 50, Our City, Our Future covered the whole of last year in preparation for producing our vision, city plan and housing policy. Getting all the information was just the first part. Now we're putting it to good use as we kick off the celebrations of our birthday and the start of our next 50 years. Knox at 50 was about the big picture, but we've also been looking at the unique parts that make up the whole too. Roeville, for instance, has been the focus of an innovative program of talking, listening and planning. It has involved the forming of the Roeville Community Reference Group and looked at a whole range of questions about the future of the area. In Ferntree Gully 2, we've started work on a village structure plan and we finished a village streetscape upgrade just before Christmas 2012. In the exciting and historic precinct of Stamford Park, we've seen more progress towards realising a truly attractive and vibrant place. Frankly, with even what we've seen so far, it's going to become one of the key jewels in the crown of our city's attractions. We completed a biannual tree audit of half of the Bush Boulevard that lines Burwood Highway in Knox, as well as the associated works such as dead tree removal. We've also made sure we completed some general maintenance of the Burwood Highway site, including weeding and remulching and planting. For our plans of the Knox Central Precinct, the Draft Precinct Master Plan continues to progress well. Much of the detail will be finished over the coming year as Council's investment profile in the precinct becomes clearer. This will time nicely with other key stakeholders finishing their internal planning processes. Further afield, we kept our eyes on what's happening in the rest of Melbourne and contributed to a submission on the Metro Planning Strategy Discussion Paper in collaboration with the Eastern Region Group of Councils. The Mayor and Director of City Development have also been actively participating in the development of the Metro Strategy.